Welcome to Dark Theory Incorporated. In the realms of folklore, mythology, and religious texts, demons are often depicted as supernatural entities with malevolent intentions. These entities are believed to originate from various cultures and belief systems, each presenting their own unique characteristics and abilities. While demonology varies across different traditions, I will provide you with a general narration of what a demon is and how one can be attacked by them. In many belief systems, demons are described as malevolent spirits or fallen angels that have turned away from goodness or divine purpose. They are often associated with chaos, temptation, and evil. Demons are said to possess a wide range of powers, including the ability to manipulate emotions, exert control over individuals, and even inflict physical harm. According to traditional law, there are several ways one can be attacked or targeted by demons. It's important to note that these descriptions are based on myths and legends and may not align with personal beliefs or scientific explanations. Here are a few common accounts. Possession, one of the most well-known forms of demonic attack is possession. It is believed that a demon can enter and take control of a person's body, influencing their thoughts, actions, and behaviors. Possession can manifest through symptoms such as sudden personality changes, speaking in unknown languages, exhibiting extraordinary strength, or engaging in self-harm. Oppression, demons can also subject individuals to a state of oppression. In this scenario, a person may experience relentless torment, mental anguish, and a feeling of being under constant attack. This can manifest as nightmares, hallucinations, persistent negative thoughts, or a sense of being watched or followed. Spiritual attacks, demons are often associated with spiritual attacks, targeting a person's faith, beliefs, and spiritual well-being. These attacks can take various forms, such as intense feelings of fear, doubt, or hopelessness, or the appearance of dark apparitions or threatening entities during moments of vulnerability, such as sleep or meditation. Curses and hexes, it is believed that demons can be summoned or directed by individuals who possess knowledge of dark arts and witchcraft. These individuals may intentionally invoke demonic forces to harm others by casting curses or hexes. Such attacks can result in a wide range of negative effects, including physical illness, financial ruin, relationship troubles, or a string of misfortunes. It is essential to remember that these descriptions are rooted in mythology, religious beliefs, and cultural folklore. Modern understandings of mental health, psychology, and the power of suggestion provide alternative explanations for many experiences that were historically attributed to demons. Exploring such experiences from a scientific perspective can help provide a more comprehensive understanding of the phenomena associated with these beliefs. Please like share and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. If you would like to see more content like this please hit the bell for notification of our future episodes. Stay safe folks and see you in the next video.